All right, guys, so after the first fiasco with the potatoes and the wedges that I asked him to cut, I gave him special instructions yesterday. So I instructed him to cut it in half lengthways and then cut it in four pieces. No, 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 no. So this is, this is what he's done, guys. Look at this. Does this look like a potato veg? No, not at all. What a straight lines. You said, could it thrice? That's it. No, I That's said. That's what you said. Yeah, okay. I then Get said. Get a potato, cut it thrice. No. We don't did that. <laughs> Hold on. And now, you, sure? now you're bothered. Okay. So just keep it on there. Okay. So what I told you to do, where's the knife? Where's the big knife? It'll be in the wash. So, what I basically told you to do is say this was a whole potato. This was the whole potato, so the other half is there. Yeah. So this was a whole potato. Yeah. So this is what I asked you to do. Cut it like that. Yeah. And then cut it one, You two. didn't say that though, did you? That's exactly no, what I was trying to explain. <laughs> Oh my god! And oh my god, no, I can't, guys. He's a man. He's too much of a man. So yeah, clearly. At least it was partly done. I can't, well, I don't really know what to say to you, babe. I don't. I don't know. You're not gonna ask me to do it no more. I will ask you to do it again. Why? Because now I've still shown you. I still don't know. I don't know what you're talking. <laughs> so do you mess it up on purpose so that I don't? I leave you alone. Because yeah, if that's basically. the case, then that's not gonna happen, is it? Basically. Alright guys, so first I parboil the potatoes until they're about um just they just they basically start to boil. Um as you can see, boiling, turn that off, empty the water, and then season the potatoes. I'll show you that in a sec. So I've emptied the water and now I'm just gonna season the potatoes. And to season the potatoes I use um some paprika powder basically as flavoring um black pepper salt and some mixed herbs so this is just my standard for whenever i make wedges so i just put that and then once i put all the mixture i just drizzle some organic peanut oil it's so nice just drizzle that over on top, put them in the oven. I'm hungry, Bab. You're hungry. I'm hungry. We You're did. hungry. I'm just seasoning the potatoes as I just told them. And so I put salt, pepper, paprika, and and now about to put some mixed herbs and some oil don't be stingy just you know <laughs> get it all in there um, and then i'm gonna mix it and put it in the preheated oven Pre preheated preheated oh yeah oh yeah mix it in good yeah <laughs> That is good, yes. That is good, yeah. And then we've got the meat. So I'll show them how I season the meat in one sec. Being impatient. You feeling impatient? I feel I was being impatient, yeah. Um. Looking good, looking good. And there they are. Beautiful potato wedges. Uh, let's see. 
So try not to have them stacking on each other if you can avoid that because we want each one to get nice and crispy. Crispy! Seasoning us there. Get on there. Okay. I want to just put that on, so I'll wait for that to heat up. In the meantime, you use the same things basically to season without the materials. Oh. Season your meat. She's shooting those guys. Oh, shut up, Dad. Shut your pie mouth. No, serious. When she starts shutting doors. What are you doing? What are you doing? So I got some vinegar. Some organic vinegar. I think it's apple cider vinegar. Just a tiny bit. But don't be stingy. A tiny bit, but don't be stingy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, and that's the pairing. Worcester sauce. No, it's Worcester sauce. <laughs> but Joe's mom hates it when I pronounce words as they are because in England instead of Leicester it's spelled Leicester but you say Leicester and it's the same with Worcester which is Wor spelled Worcester and which one are, which other one is it that's like that there's a few there's a few like that there's a few like that and it's annoying because if you're a foreigner and coming into this country might need to turn that fan out but just for a quick sec while I talk Well, she complained about... Yeah, as I was saying, as a foreigner coming into this country, it's very difficult because you come here, with the first time I came here, my one of the stops was Leicester. So I was like, oh, I'm in Le Leicester. And they were like, Leicester. People looked at me like, I thought I was crazy. Yes, I use a lot of salt. Clearly. It's flavor in there. Oh, it's blown. <laughs> You just told me to turn off the fan. I know, because it's too loud. You could hear it in the background. So yeah, um, so pepper, Worcester sauce, and then onion powder and garlic powder, and that's it. What, what we then do is put it in the grill. If you don't have a grill, then I would advise to flat fry it, get it brown on both sides, and then put it on low heat in the oven to slow cook. He's <laughs> zooming in, Dad. Making love to that meat. Mm. some rosemary excuse me What are you putting on now, babe? Mustard. Dijon mustard. Mustard. That's my French, by the way. Nice. Sorry to all the Frenchies out there. <sighs> Looking good, babe. And, alright, guys. So, in short, what I put on there is some, oh, it's white wine vinegar, some Lee Perrin's Worcestershire sauce. What's the sauce? <laughs> What's the sauce? What's the sauce? Um, mustard, black pepper, salt, paprika, garlic powder, and some 
onion. <gasps> that was a good no! one. I think I managed to save it, it wasn't too bad. Yeah, that was good. Good stuff. Good stuff, good stuff. And my phone, my poor phone. My phone has been through so much, Bab. <laughs> I'm glad it's not an iPhone because it would have broken. Shut by up, Bab! <laughs> if it was an iPhone, it would have been broken by now. Um, I am Team iPhone, Ida is Team Samsung. I'm Team whatever phone doesn't so. break after three seconds. Do you know what? I want to. No, this is what we're gonna do. I want people to comment down below. Team iPhone, Team Samsung. Let's we see. Know that team let's see, gonna... let's see who comes out okay. on top. Team iPhone. There's more people with iPhone, but I feel like. No, no, no. Why, why, why are you going back? Why, why are you going back, back. on you? No, I'm not going back. There's more people with an iPhone. I'm not disputing that. Okay. But there will be more people that say Team iPhone. Okay. But whoever's had Samsung will always tell you that Samsung is the best phone out there in terms of um, value for money and in terms of everything that you need. Whatever. Facts. Whatever. You've just been factorized. <laughs> factorized? <laughs> factorized. So, this bit you can avoid because it's actually not necessary because there's so much fat. But I'm just going to drizzle. If you have one of those drizzler things, then that's fine. You don't need to do it. And <laughs> you guys should see Joe in the background. He's so like... I'm like, wait, I'm like, what's his face like, on the um, nature shows? I know. Oh, what's his name? The old guy, babe, what's his name? Make sure you wash your hands because I use my hands a lot when I'm cooking. I'm old school like that, and to be fair, when I'm eating as well. If I'm eating at home, I don't care. <laughs> and then I just put that in the grill. But before I put the grill on, I just want to check. Oh, I put it on in low heat. So that's the first, second, third. Never put it on the highest. I might start out on the low and then put it up high. But we just want to check where our potatoes are. Because if our potatoes are nowhere near ready, then what we'll have to do is leave it on low heat. But if they're almost ready, we can crank. Crank it, it up. Crank it up. So hot, It's so flat. So hot. There we go. Ready? Yeah. So, that's the potato. Ice warm. Let me put that down. So as you can see, that's looking all right. That looks like. Yeah, that's not going to take too much longer. So I'll, I'll put that on the second heat. And then just turn these around. I'm just going to use tongs. Obviously, if you have too many, then you can just go like this and turn them around. But I just want to make sure that each individual one gets the care and love that it requires. Ah, the breaking back. They're not crisp enough. They're not done. So shut your pipe on. <laughs> Let's look at Joe's little friend. Turn around, babe. Let them see her. This is Shadow. See how her claws are out. She loves it. She loves being stroked. Yes. You love your big brother, don't you? Ah. Uh, she loves it, huh? She is she purring? Let me let me go close so they can hear. I turn the camera. Go on, shadow purr. Oh, there we go. Say hello to the people. Say hello, people. Hello, little Jordans. Hello! Oh, he looks so happy. This is the only way to shut her up. She's always meowing. Otherwise, she's... Oh, she's tucking my back as well. But she's padding. Are you padding? Yes, you padding. I think she just leave being, like being high up. Probably. It's alright, Shadow. I like being up there as well. <laughs> Alright guys, that's the lamb chops done. 
so they're very well done obviously but if you don't want them to be well done you can just leave them for less time in the oven and that's the potatoes so you just have this with basically the lamb potatoes and some salad and that's dinner done very easy and very quick the train so that's why I didn't feel her coming out check the baggage she's come for 